let's take a look at how to make use of react developer tools by inspecting some of the sites so here i have airbnb website it shows regional version for me however some of the content is still us based but it shows me the localized version which is also made with react if you check the top bar here for react developer tools it will show you highlighted also if you have react detector tool then it will also show you this blue color okay so if you see this that means the site is completely developed with react okay if it shows gray then you can see that the site is not made with react or partially in some components it may have react okay you don't need two tools you have one react developer tool which is more than enough for detecting and inspecting the website however previously react developer tool didn't have this icon option so we used to try react detector for that but now react developer tools extension alone can do inspection as well as detection job okay so to inspect the page you can right click and inspect similarly you can also click on this hamburger menu on chrome then more tools then developer tools And you will find that from the bottom side or side by side you can see this elements right here now here you will find that bunch of tabs based on your extension and default features but it, if you have installed react developer tools then it will add one tab react right here it will connect and fetch all the elements which are made with react okay as you can see it lets you check all the specific elements and as you take your mouse over them it will get highlighted so at the top you can see this component gets highlighted okay and it shows component information Okay, and on the right hand side here, you can see it shows props. And in some cases, it may show also the state. Right now, none of the properties here are giving much information right now because a lot of that is under this expansion tab. Okay, so you click on that and they expand. Okay, if you don't expand them, you will feel that it has very low set of props. We have to expand them to get much deep information about each of these props. Same with the state. And as you know, props and state are important concepts in React. So you get information about props, state, and context in this tab as well. Okay. So whenever you highlight any element, it will show props and state here okay also it may show you some of the additional information about this components okay and any property that you may make manually change here may show temporary change on the page as well so for development purpose this can be handy inspector tool Okay, so you can select this, make changes as you see fit, and this can be really handy. So this was a short demo on how to inspect sites for your React development using React developer tools.